Let's talk about the artist Richard Serra. He did not think the function of art was to be pleasing. He actually just died yesterday. And to really understand and appreciate his work, you kind of have to know the backstory. Art of Richard Serra is incredibly loved now. It wasn't always. In the 80s, the New York government commissioned him to do a piece. It was giant oxidized steel, 12 feet high, 120 feet long, and it was placed outside these New York federal buildings. A lot of people hated it. Over a thousand people signed a commission to get rid of this piece. Then it was brought to the government. A whole trial ensued and the government decided that it needed to be taken down. Richard Serra was incredibly upset. He sued the government and didn't go anywhere because the government was like, hey, we commissioned you to do it. We can do whatever we want. Fair. But then the love and appreciation started when he started to do curves. In his own words, he said that people were ready for curves. He makes these massive sculptures out of oxidized steel, just like the ones before, but they are curved. And it really isn't pleasing. The oxidized steel is kind of gross, kind of weird. Walk through them and it's very haunting. They are massive. So you know that they're not gonna fall, but like they could, and that's a whole aspect to it. His whole goal throughout his entire art career is to bring a viewer into a space physically instead of just optically. This happens with these flat ones. People just were not ready until the curves. 